multiples. You did. Mm-hmm. He did. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hi, everyone. How are you? Good evening. Welcome to Wednesday Night Live. <laughs> yeah, it's Gloria, Michelle, Brudy, and Amina. Good evening. So I was laughing when we went, when we went live a few minutes ago because I'm like, oh my God, we already got a hundred thumbs up. Like, who's doing all that? And guess who it was? You'll Who's never guess. <laughs> wasn't me. It wasn't me. There's only three of us here. Yeah. Only three. <clears throat> oh my, Hi. Uh, my chair is Riley. <laughs> Hi, Liz. Hey, Liz, Miriam. Miriam. Hi, Jeannie. Jeannie. Pam and Lini and Diana. And Lini and Diana. All right. Are you keeping your thumbs up? All our Hello. friends are joining us. Stop it. He's looking. He's at 200 thumbs I up. I know. You need to stop. Too You're bad we can't. Yes, the, the producer. producer is. He's giving Hi, his Jill. own thumbs up. Hi, Norma. Hey, Norma. Hi, Nicole. Nicole. Oh, there's Miss Sylvia. Oh, he's giving himself thumbs up. Not us, huh? Not us. How good I do. We don't count. So what did you guys think of our new intro? Did you guys like it? This chair is squeaky. Are you giving the thumbs up now? No. Okay, oh. I'm just making sure. <laughs> You, if you Check them out on the hand. thumbs up. No, no, no. Up. <laughs> Don't give it, man. I think we need some WD-40 for this chair. Is it squeaking? Yeah, listen. Can, I wonder oh. if they can hear it. Can you Every guys hear it? Lynn is squeaking. Squeaky. <laughs> Sounds like my knees. <laughs> Are your knees squeaking again? <laughs> my crack. They don't squeak. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hi, Nancy. Good to see you guys. I'm just... Who's thumbs up? Are you thumbs up? No. Us? no? Okay. Right. So maybe they do like our background. Maybe. It is Isn't a nice it a pretty background. background? Yeah. The producer created it. We were talking about the one that was in the intro. Yes. Yes, <laughs> you could hear me. <laughs> Squeaky. <laughs> Where's that WD-40? Oh, my goodness. Maybe uh, Beto will let me borrow his sewing machine oil. Oh, you can hear the squeak. Okay, we need it's to. pretty bad. We'll either need to <laughs> Oil this chair, or we need to get you another chair. chair. I'm going to sit very, very still. Okay, don't move. Don't breathe. Breathe, though. Okay. (laughs) (laughs) Maybe you're squeaky because you had the day off today and left me to fend for myself. Me and Amina to fend for ourselves. I know, it's terrible when there's only two in the store. It's hard. It's funny. It's very hard. So what else is new, you guys? Are you guys doing well? Are you guys enjoying summer? It's we been, are. It's, it's fast. It's finally kind of cooled off a little bit. It's been really muggy here. We went Weird. to the beach on Monday. Was it Monday, Ram? Monday. We went to yeah. Hermosa. Oh, nice. It was beautiful. It was really nice. Well, kind good. of kind of breezy by the water, but mm-hmm. it was good. It was really nice. We got boba and Hi, crepes. Pam. Yeah, we got boba and crepes. Ooh, nice. Oh, my God. The crepes were so good, Where'd you guys. Where did you get the crepes from? There's a crepes place on, I'm not even sure what street it was. Do you know what street it was? No, he won't know. Did it run east and west or north and south? Oh, gosh, Lynn. That's even worse than the street name. <laughs> That's even worse than the street name. Did it go this way or this way? This way. This way? This way. Hmm. I if it's like man. Crepes a la crepes, something yeah. like that. Crepe a la crepe. crepe or crepe something. Oh, my God. So we had, so the kids had, they shared, they had, um, the Nutella with banana. Yeah, Nutella Ooh, with banana. That sounds good. It was really good. And then I had, what did I have? Dulce de leche. Oh, dulce oh, de leche. Of that course. was really good. Oh. I tried to buy that thing. It's full of sugar. Oh, it was really good. Lots of sugar. Very healthy for You're me. <laughs> I was, needless to say, I was wired. <laughs> I was very excited the rest of the afternoon. I oh magic oh, pan. Oh magic pan. Where's I remember magic? that. Oh really? Yeah. You gotta try this place, ago. Chidi. It's really cool. In Hermosa. Oh, it's too hot. Oh, is there forest fires there, Broody? Oh, I hate That's fires. A bummer. Yeah. I hate fires. Oh, there's one in Redondo too, a good great place. Oh, okay. Yeah, this one was in Hermosa. It was fun. It was really good. Okay, my friends, so um, we have some something really fun to show you. Rand, do you want to share, just change the camera just for a second here? Mm-hmm. Thank you. Okay, so 
I know this event is actually full and closed. However, I just thought you guys should see the samples because they're just so darn stinking cute. They're very cute. So check out this pillow. So my friends who are going to be sewing with us over the weekend, this is what we are making. We are going to be embroidering these um, dimensional lace is one project and then we're going to add it to this pillow and we have the the leather and we have their glitter vinyl and the regular vinyl and their felt i mean really stinking cute and these pom-poms are so oh, soft they're so soft they are so soft they're oh it's my god Lena used like to make it so on so here's the thing so on sundays my husband makes crepes for all of us or crepes or he does breakfast i should say and so this Sunday he didn't make anything because he was just busy. And so on Monday when we got crepes, he was texting us like, where are you guys at? I'm like, oh, we're at a crepe shop. He goes, oh, I see how it is. Just because I don't make you breakfast <laughs> on Sunday, you guys go have crepes. I'm like, yep, 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 yep. So anyway, so that's the first project. Here, I'll test out this pillow. And then there's this project, this beautiful towel. And this towel, you can see there's gold, um, their leather gold mylar it looks like and oh. then I think it's their gold mylar and then the leather oh, and then look at the little tassel -y things it's really cute and then we have this little dimensional little pumpkin isn't he cute we it's do all the embroidery it's on velveteen really fun and then look at this one okay wait 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 let me get it organized here are they going to be able to see the lights? Maybe I should show it this tipped way the, first. It tipped up. Oh, it's too light. So you, I don't know if you guys could see if I put my finger. There are, li there are lights here that, um, there's lights inside, so you can see them through. So if I go like this, there's the roof, but you can kind of see. Uh, it's Rian's really going to turn cute. off the lights for a second. Try. You want to turn off the lights and see? Oh, okay, that looks lot better. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. You can kind of see. Isn't that cute? So cute. Oh, my oh God, Rayan, he's gonna turn off Rayan's all the lights. into it. Oh, oh yeah. Look at that. That looks really That's good. That's why he's the producer, Lynn. Exactly. And we're just, we're just the worker bees here. Yeah. This is that the, look is how cute, cute that looks. I know. That's really fun. So these are our projects for the event. We're good. And you can change the camera angle. Oops. Oops, oops, you're, you're <laughs> he's so now. excited. <laughs> he likes the little oh, house. Turn, oh yeah, he's gonna turn our, our lights back on. Our lights back There we on. go. Yes, yeah, so we look bright. Oh, I almost went to sleep there for a second. <laughs> <laughs> no sleep. Look at that one no day off. No on the job. Two days off, and she's like, she's sleeping on the job Ready already. Ready to take a nap. I know. All right, my friends, so okay. we are going to get started. I'm um, going to get the squeaky chair out of here and go to my workstation. All See right. you guys. You're going to squeak on out of here? Too bad there weren't sirens to cover my squeaky chair. I know. There was right before we went on live, there were some sirens. So today we've got some really fun. We're going to do end of bolts today since we have been cleaning house and we've got a lot of um, bolts that we want to move out of here and pass the savings on to you guys. Um, I still have about eight boxes I haven't opened, so it's just crazy how much fabric I keep getting. And so we're gonna do end of bolt, and then we're gonna do, we have notions, and then we have deal of the day. So fun stuff. So we're ready, Ram. We are ready. Oh, what's that? <laughs> the sirens. <laughs> All right, so he's gonna change the camera, I believe. I hope. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, thanks, Lynn. And where's my little cheat sheet here? I need to get organized here. Okay, I am organized. So our first fabric, whoops. Oh, Bertie, you like end of bolt. Awesome. We all love it too. So this one here is this beautiful batik fabric, um, fabric number one, and a bolt. And this is two and an eighths yard of fabric. Two and an eighths yard of fabric. Number one. Such a pretty color. Puzzle pieces, yeah, it does look like puzzle pieces. 
All right, number two is coming. Um, let me just turn this light off and move all this out of the way around so that I can make room. Okay, so number two is um, another end of bolt. Number two is two and two third yards of fabric. Two and two third yards of fabric. I know, but this is more like a salmon color, don't you think? Yeah. A little bit salmon y. It's gorgeous, though. Two and two thirds. All right, the next batik is another two and two third yards, and this is a um, softer pink with the, um, it looks like kind of a rust color on top. So it's a fun combination. You don't see it too, too often. So number three also has two and two third yards of fabric. Two and two third yards. Okay, moving right along to actual fabric that's on the bolt. Number four. So number four has two and a half yards of fabric, two and a half yards. Two and a half yards. Number five is um, one and one third yards. Now this one is interesting. It looks like a little like like it's crackly. Um, it's a good good piece of fabric for Halloween, which is you know around the corner, I think. <laughs> can't believe it. Not too far off. Halloween is around the corner. Scary to think that. So that one is um, one and one third. It's very spooky to it's think that. Very sp yeah, it's very spooky to think that, Rayon says. <laughs> oh, it's candy corn season right now. Oh, candy corn. And I still have leftovers from the last bag. <laughs> Number six. Number six is blue clouds or blue sky with white clouds. And number six is one and seven eighths. One and seven eighths yard. Hey, Connie, welcome. Hi, fancy pants. Good to see you guys. So number six, one and seven eighths. So for those of you who want to do landscape quilts, this is a good one for it. Number seven. Number seven is um, one and one eighths yard. One and an eighth yard. So this is a rustish color and it has the leaves splattered throughout in metallic gold. So one and seven eighths. I'm sorry, one and one eighths. Yeah, one and one eighths. Soul to Nancy. Okay, number eight. Number eight are hearts, and number eight is two and an eighth yard of fabric. Two and an eighth yard of fabric. So remember, the prices for the end of bolt are eight ninety nine a yard, and you just take whatever is on the bolt. So this one here, number eight, has two and one eighths yard of fabric. I love the fact that the hearts are small scale, medium scale, small scale, and they have all the different colors, red, pinks. So cute with pillowcases. Adorable pillowcases. Yeah. It's very bright red, pinks, yellows. It's very bright, it's beautiful. Very cheerful. You didn't catch the fact that I said yellows. Oh, <laughs> bright and yellow. Did you say yellows? Yeah. We had a conversation earlier about Rayon's color blindness. Number nine. Number nine. Number nine has three yards on it. Good time for gathering your Halloween fabric. Number nine. Three yards. This year I'm going to decorate my house for Halloween. Okay, Ryan? You're going to help me. I need to start though. I need to start making stuff. 
Number 10. Number 10 is an interesting piece. It is, um, a, oh, do I want to say a gray, like a deep gray? Yeah. Like a, slate blue. a slate blue, yeah, yeah, and these vertical lines with the little circles. Um, it's very different, very modern, I want to say. So this one is two and three eighths yard of fabric. Two and three eighths yards of fabric. My brain Number can't 10. like figure out what color that is. Your brain can't figure out what color it is. Yeah, uh -huh. it's different. It's, it's beautiful. Like, very elegant. Elegant and modern. I feel like. All right, I love this blue. Look at this. Oh my goodness. So that one's that ombre. This is an ombre fabric, my friends. So it basically, um, let me see if I can show you, because you need to see this. Hey, Marty, welcome. Oh yeah, look at, see how on one side of it, let me see, one side of it, so this is end to end. Um, you've got the light, and it goes to the dark, and then you turn it over and it's going all the way to the dark. Super fun. So this one is number 11 and number 11 has one and a quarter yards of fabric. And it's gone. Number 12, number 12 is two and two third yards of fabric. Two and two third yards of fabric. Two and two third yards. Number thirteen is a batik. Number thirteen is two and a quarter yards of fabric. Two and a quarter yards of fabric. Did you hear that, Ram? What was that? It sounded like the van broke down that was outside before it started. Oh, uh, something. You could hear a car getting stuck or something. Number 13, two and a quarter yards of fabric. This is a popular batik print in the sense that they always have these dots in various colors and they always bring them out. Um, but this one, I like the fact that it has multiple colors as well. Yeah, it's gorgeous. And then this one is one of my favorites. I don't know why I love it because it's so like scribbleish, you know, it's so like childish, playfulness. I don't know, what's the word I'm looking for? It is happy. And this one here is um, three yards. Three yards. Hi, Elaine. That's okay. Better late than never. I know, Liz. I'm watching the numbers. We are at 33, so we're definitely going to get draw three names. Let's try to get to four this week, my friends. You need to tell all your friends that we're live on Facebook, and we've got some great fabric and great deals every week. Six to 40. Six to 40? What? Six people to 40. Oh, yeah. Oh, six more people. Got it. God, I'm like, what? Six to 40, what? <laughs> Ran. That's exactly what you're talking about. Ran, you got to, like, spell it out Elaborate. for me. We thought it was uh, some game score. I know. I'm like, what are you saying? Who's playing tonight? Basketball's over. All right, number 15. It's a very soft pink. Number 15 has one and a quarter yards of fabric. One and a quarter yards of fabric. Alright, who is a cat person? Who is a cat person? Look at this. It's super cute with the kitty cats and the stockings or the socks or oh my god, it's just adorable. So number 16 has three and a half yards of fabric. Three and a half yards.
three and a half yards. Number 17. 17 are the famous dots. And this one is the small dots. And number 17 is two and a quarter yards of fabric. Two and a quarter yards of fabric. Number 18 is a batik, and number 18 is two and a third yards of fabric. Two and a third yards of fabric. And it's a batik. Oh, which one is Amon's favorite color? Which number, Mom? I want the green. The green? Really? That's his favorite color, huh? I had no idea. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. Can color can can you have a favorite color if you're colorblind, Ram? Yeah, I like purple, even though I confuse it with blue. <laughs> maybe you really like blue. Yeah, maybe you like blue and you think it's purple, and yeah. purple you think it's blue, and you're really confused at that point. Well, whatever color purple is to me, I like it. That's interesting. All right, so number eighteen has two and a third yards of fabric. Mom, I like your profile picture. You and Dad know, look so, so cute. cute. I know, it's so cute. I'm just looking at that right now. Two and a third yards of fabric. Isn't that cute, Ryan? Okay, number 19. 19 is two yards. Number 19 is two yards of fabric. Cheerful and bright. Cheerful and bright, yep. Number 20, an animal print. Number 20, check this one out. Number 20 has one and five eighths yard. One and five eighths yard of fabric. Number 21, number 21, um, this is the little X's, um, or the little kisses is what they call it, and it's a green background. Yeah, I'm trying to adjust the color here real quick, Let's see if I can So 21, 21 is 1 and 7 eighths, 1 and 7 eighths, 1 and 7 eighths yard. Twenty two. Twenty two has two and a half yards. For all of our football lovers. Wow, that's just right the I know, I know. Two and a half yards. Do you watch football, Lynn? The last five minutes. <laughs> the last five minutes, yeah. <laughs> I'm not much of a football person. I only watch the Super Bowl <laughs> for one game of the year. <laughs> Number 23. 23 is two and an eighth yard of fabric. Two and one eighth yard of fabric. Ooh, a lot of thumbs up. A lot of thumbs up for football. It's not me. And I know it's not you, Ryan, because I see where your hands are. I'm watching your hands. <laughs> Two and a half yards. 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 Two and a half y
two and one eighth. So this one here is like a lavender background with the little circles and the circles are all like dots to make that circle, like a little dot formation, it's kind of fun. Another different colorway. The next one reminds me of like, um, like twigs or something that falls from the tree that kind of make a mess on the ground. <laughs> Pine needles. Pine needles? Is that what that is? Yes. What do you say? Are these pine needles? Oh, yeah. Kurt's right, right? Like pine needles. 24 has two yards. See, color may not be my thing. Yeah, color is not your thing. But, but, uh, trees but you know, are. but trees are. Okay. <laughs> these are pine, whatever, whatever they are. So this has a beige background. It has a little bit of a darker shade, and then it has these little these little things that kind of let me see if it says something on the end a walk on the path oh well there you go maybe yeah maybe it is ran it, it, it is yeah, I can tell. so that reminds me for those of you who have ordered fabric from last week's facebook sale um we are still processing that those orders but we'll, you should be getting a call tomorrow they're all cut ready to go we'll give you guys a call tomorrow um, for last week's Facebook order. Lynn's looking at me like... Well, that pop sign is flashing. Yeah, it's, it's flickering. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's not a good thing, though. Um, I bet it would be lovely with holiday things, yeah. Pine needles, we have a tree out front. Oh, Patricia, yeah. Interesting. So, Rand, you got it right. It was pine needles. Mm -hmm. 24, uh, 24, 25. 25 is one and three quarter yards of fabric. One and three quarter yards of fabric. Plain, plain solid. Yep. Plain solid. All right, 25 is one and three quarter yards of fabric. Oh, look at this batik. 26. Isn't this a beauty? What was that? That's one of my favorites. This one? Yeah, it's gorgeous. 26 is four and three eighths yards. So that's a good chunk. It's great for a backing. Right? I love the combination. I love the movement. And the nice thing is for a backing, if you're practicing your free motion embroidery or if you're doing it on the machine, it's so busy that, you know, if something happens, you won't see it. No one will know. That's exactly right. So 26 has four and three eighths yard of fabric. Oh, tw did I say 24? 26. Oh my goodness, Salima. 26. 27. 27. Um, I like this fabric. So 27 is a cream fabric with some mottled, a little bit darker cream all scattered throughout. So it's a great background fabric. So 27 has two yards. So it's a great background fabric. Twenty-seven has two yards. So my friends, just to remind you, I have a virtual event coming up. Let me just show that to you real quick. Um, it is on Wednesday, August 11th. Um, at 11 a.m. and it's how to embroider on paper and make your own cards. So with the holidays coming up, you may want to make cards for your family or your friends, your loved ones, and, it, and this talks about how to do that. And it's a free event and it's a virtual event. So mark your calendars and you, can, you do need to sign up though even though it's free. Wednesday, August 11th. 
And speaking of classes, let me talk about one more. We have the McKenzie bag, Saturday, August 28th at 10 o'clock. And that is a um, virtual class as well, taught by Nancy Tafoya. So this bag is a really nice size bag. Has, um, I don't know if it has a zipper on the top. I don't remember. Yeah, I don't remember about it. it. doesn't mention anywhere about a zipper, so maybe not. Um, but anyways, this is all cork. Actually, everything here is cork, except for the lining. But you don't have to do it with cork. You can do it with, you know, cottons. Um, but it's just a fun, fun pattern. Fun. It'll be a fun class. So that's Saturday, August 28th. And all of these are on my website, so you can sign up directly on our website. Okay. So number 28 is one yard, and it's a plain black with some mottled um, patterning throughout the fabric. So number 28 is one yard. You can never have enough black fabric. Just like you can never have enough black clothes. Mm -hmm. That's my motto. I choose black because I can't tell a lot of other colors. Yeah, it's easy. yeah black's a good color. It goes with everything. Okay, number 29. 29 is another batik. Three and, where are we? Three and three quarter yards of fabric. 29 has three and three quarter yards of fabric. Ooh, 27 was popular. What was that one? Oh, that was the beige, the cream one, yeah, yeah. So 29 is a batik and it has three and three quarter yards of fabric. All right, and number 30, I think I need to go this way on it because it has license plates on it. So for example, North Dakota, so busy um, because I said so for Arizona let's be so oops can you guys see that let's be social where's california anybody see california let's turn this around let's see oh i don't see california i mean it's got to be someplace i just don't oh here here it is i see it let me open this up Hi Eunice, welcome. The fabric is, we're doing end of bolt tonight and the fabric is $8.99 um, for eight ninety nine a yard for whatever is on the bolt. And I am trying to find, oh here it is, nab some fab. Nab some fab. That's California's. Seems like home is Montana. Oh, where is that one? Right next to California. Oh, yeah. Wild for quilts, yeah. Hilarious. Okay, so this one, number 30, has one and three-eighths yard. Number 30 has one and three-eighths yard of fabric. Okay. Are we done with end of bolts? No. No? Oh. No, I have more on my paper. Right. That's a good question. <laughs> what oh. number was that last one? 30. Found them. You found them? <laughs> oh, all the other ones fell down. Mm -hmm. okay. We oh. were missing fabric. Ran, you're hiding it from us. Okay, 31. We're almost at the end of End of Bolts. So 31 has, oops, <laughs> there goes the rest of the fabric. <laughs> It's on the floor as we speak. Oh, You're lucky they're end of bolts ran and they're not so heavy. Yeah. Um, 31 has one and a half yards of fabric. One and a half yards. Ran, you're a hot mess today. What are you doing? <laughs> you want to pick these up? <laughs> you are a mess. What's going oh, on I'm with you? I think you need to sleep more. Okay. All right, 32. 32 is one of my favorites, Lynn. I think this one is just, I don't know, it's gorgeous. It's a batik. 32 has three and three and a half yards. 
Or a dress, right? I don't, I was thinking a skirt, but a dress is right up there, Lynn. Oh, yeah, I was thinking a top. You were thinking a top? Yeah, isn't it cute? I mean, look, I'm just going to zoom. Look at that. <laughs> How long ago the tops? Oh, a tank top, you mean? <laughs> uh oh, oh Rand's reminding me about the tank tops. I thought that was all one. <laughs> no, so we haven't forgotten. Fun. We haven't forgotten our tank tops, Lynn. You obviously seem to have forgotten very easily. Thirty-three. Thirty-three is three and a half yards. Apron is perfect for this, or the or on top of a towel, like to hang a kitchen towel. You can make a whole ensemble. You can make a whole ensemble with three and a half yards. A towel. What was the first one you said? Oh, hot pad. A hot pad, apron, oven mitt. Yeah. There we go. We've just decorated somebody's kitchen. <laughs> I'd use it for my kitchen if someone would make me all those pieces. <laughs> How quickly she's passing the butt, because you know she doesn't want to do a top for me. I think your IQ people could make you some placemats. Oh, Diana Bottom. Could practically make a whole kitchen. I know, Liz, that's what we're saying. It's hilarious. Okay, so 33 is gone. Maybe I'll talk Diana into making me something. She's not like you, Lynn. She's no, nice. No. <laughs> I'm teasing. Okay, 34. 34 is a good chunk of fabric here for a backing. Four, four people to 40. And um, it is a batik, and it is four yards. And speaking of the number four, we are four shy away from 40 people, my friends. Let's go. We need 40 people. We need 40 people. So number 34 has uh, four yards. Four yards. Okay, 35, last of my end of bolts, my friends. 35 has three yards of fabric. Three yards. Make a nice sewing machine cover for the big embroidery machine. Yeah, it would make a nice sewing machine cover. Well, now we can go ahead and decorate our sewing room. We've done the kitchen. Now we can yeah, decorate the sewing, the sewing room. We're moving on. Which actually, the sewing room is more fun than the kitchen. Yes, I agree. There's no dishes. There's no dishes involved. Exactly. Dishes. Rand likes that. No dishes. Okay, my friends, we are on notions. Rand's gonna change the um, the whatever you call it. What are we calling those? Banners. 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 Yep. Banners. Twenty percent off. And I have got a slew of different notions. So today, um, I'm gonna take this one out of the package because it might be easier. These are those numbered pins. Have you guys heard of them? Have you guys seen them? These are wonderful for marking your quilt so you know what order to stitch something out in. They're already numbered for you so it takes that guesswork out. Isn't that cool? So these are 20% off. So the sale price is $23.95. So I'm just gonna give you guys the sale price. It'll just be easier. So $23.95 is the sale price. Yeah, these pins are wonderful, Evie. You're right. They're amazing. It's good when you have a quilt with a lot of pieces and you gotta keep track of it. Right, right. Lynn said the same thing that when you have a quilt. Well, you're not listening to what I just said. I just said the exact oh, same thing. <laughs> Lynn. See? Great minds think alike. Oh, nice comeback, Lynn. Yeah, <laughs> oh, my goodness. You just don't listen to me anymore, Lynn. <laughs> oh, sure. <laughs> so yes, yeah, so Lynn says the exact same thing, that you, if you have a quilt with a lot of pieces, this is a great way to keep things in order. 
on track. Okay, so um, $23.95. Um, all right, then we have 20, oh, 20. <laughs> item B, I am so out of tune with my numbering today. This is a glue stick, but it's not just a regular glue stick, my friends. It's by Quilter Select, and it's fabulous. I love it. Yes. Even Lynn said that. She's like, she's not a glue stick kind of person. Um, because Lynn doesn't pin. Lynn just sews, right? She just mm -hmm. she she just goes. And so for her to do any type of pinning or gluing, it has to be worth it. And she loves this one. So this one, the sale price is eight dollars and seventy nine cents. How can you go wrong? It's really cool. And I think this comes with um, with the refill. I think so. Yeah, so it's a glue stick and a refill. Look at that. Bargain. Bargain. Nice <laughs> what happened, Lynn? Oh, I think they're stacked too high. Ran, you really need to get a handle no, of your fabrics back uh, there. No, this look. <laughs> okay, get those they'll get those flat folds off the bottom. No, it's gonna it's gonna topple, seriously. <laughs> My f my dear friends, it's my good. son is not listening to me, and I need some inter inter intervention. intervention. <laughs> I need intervention, please. He's it's, not listening. It's good. No, seriously, it's gonna fall. <laughs> I know it fell twice. It's gonna fall, and then, then, then the know. alarm company will call me at midnight, and I'm not gonna be a happy camper if nope. I have to come to the store at midnight. Wake up, Ray, I'm gonna make you come to the store and fix the fabrics. Ooh, can I draft? Okay, so the next thing we have is a set of three fat quarters. So we have the next few are some um, fat quarter bundles, and we thought, you know, that's kind of a notion-y item, even though it's fabric, but, you know, it is what it is. And this one here is on sale for $7.19 for three fat quarters. And I've got a few of these. So item C, $7.19. Then we have item D, and look at these fabrics. Aren't they just fun? Again, three fat quarters for, um, where am I? $7.19, same price. Really, really cute. Yeah, they're gorgeous colors. Well, these are my colors. These are just so me, right? I love it. And Paisley, whoever's into Paisley. This is perfect. How many of these do I have, Lynn? Those, you have four of them. I have only four of these, so I've got one left. One left. Okay, and what about E? How many do I have? Only one. All right, so this next one, I have one of these, and this one here is a five pack, and it's a five pack, and it's on sale for $11, but it's um, it's sewing theme. So if you got your thimbles and then you've got all the coordinating fabric, these are the three that um, have the same print, but they coordinate that. And then you have this beautiful gray. So super fun, super fresh, very, you know, light and airy, and it's gone. Okay, so that's that. And here's another sewing themed one, and this is item F, and this one here is also five fat quarters. And look at this, and I only have one of these two. This one here has your sewing machine, it's got that same pink that I showed you earlier, it's got a light gray, and a turquoise-ish, aqua-ish color, I guess aqua, and then some wordings. So again, everything color coordinated together, and they're beautiful. And this one is gone. This one was also $11. Okay. Moving right along here. Oh, what's this? Okay. This one is G. And G, I only have one of, of as well, right? Correct. All right. These are just kind of my one-offs here. You have one of everything else left. Too. Oh, got it. Okay. So one of everything else. He's so clever. Okay. So G is twenty two thirty nine on sale. And it has... Um, now these are half yard bundles. 
this is a half yard. So five half yard bundles, that's why the price is more. So this one is $22.39 and it's got this beautiful floral and it's got all the coordinating pieces to go with it. Look at that with the metallic and the black. I love the, pe the, the little, um, whatever, plaid looking in the black and the pink. And that one, and that one is gone. Then I have another one which is in batiks. And it's also five half yard pieces. And, oh, banner says end of bolt. How about that? I changed it. I, yeah, I did see 20%. Yeah. I don't know what happened. Okay. Thanks, Elaine. Um, okay, so this one here is H, and H is also 2239. And so it's a boutique. So it's got this beautiful um, fall colored print and then all the coordinating fabrics to go with it. So again, five half yard pieces. And that one is gone. Then I have the last of the fabrics. So this one is I, and this one is a patriotic fabric collection. So again, it's got some patriotic themed, let's do it this way so you guys can see it right side up. Well, I guess it doesn't matter because statues upside down. Um, anyway, so then you've got the blue, and then you've got the stars, and then you've got a red, and then you've got another patriotic. Super, super fun. So you guys can get ready for a Labor Day weekend, right? So this one here is 22, 39, five half yard pieces. So again, let me show them to you. It's got the, the main piece and then the coordinating pieces. Okay, all right, so that one is I. And the next one is going to be, it's the same banner, yep. Oh. It's 20% 20, 20 off, yep. That's okay, you got this. Okay, the next one here is J, actually I'll just do it like this. And this is a total, totally tubular pressing station. And it's by um, Dime, the Designs in Machine Embroidery. And this one here is just um, great when you are making purses. And when you make purses and you have to do a lot of pressing because it has, let me scoop this up, it has a couple of different size um, boards so that you can do your pressing. Um, so if you do a lot of purses, this is fabulous. And then you can also purchase the wool mats that are the exact same size. So you've got wool mats for the big and then wool mats for the small as well. So this one here, the regular price is $129.99 and it's on sale for $103.99. And this one, there's no um, limitation. So um, if I sell out, I can always get more. So not to worry about this one. So if you're interested, just let me know and we'll make sure you get you get one. So a to uh, totally tubular pressing station. It's fabulous. Okay, next we're gonna go on to deal of the day. Deal of the day. So deal of the day are a lot of one-offs so they're just so I'm starting off with patterns um, well as I said that the first one I think I have two of is that right yeah you have two. okay so right off the bat I I told a mistruth so this one here um, K is um, $11 and it's 50% off and this one is a backpack not a backpack a um, they're calling it a movie night serger bag. So it's actually made on a serger, which is a lot of fun because there's not very many patterns uses a serger and it's a great way to utilize the wonderful sergers that you guys have, especially if you have a baby lock. So this one here is 50% off. I do have two of these and um, it's 10.95, less 50%. Okay, 
then the next one is a pattern um, from Cozy Quilt Designs and it is $10 and it's called Stars Within. So it's basically $5 on sale. And I only have one. Everything else I just have one of now. All right, we need one more person to join. If we can get four, we can draw four names, Rayon. One more person. Make some phone calls. Text your girlfriends. <laughs> what was that? No, they need to be legit customers, Lynn. <laughs> oh my goodness, you cracked me up. Okay, braid runner. This is a fun pattern. If you're looking for a quick runner, um, especially if you, I, just, I wonder if this is for two and a half inch strips. Um, I don't know, it says one eighth yard of six fabrics, maybe. Um, in any case, it's sold, but it's a, it's a fun pattern for a runner. And then this one here is for someone who wants to do some landscape and is a skier. So this one here is $10 and it's $5 um, with the 50% off and it is um, the, the snow, the mountains, so it's a fun landscape quilt or a wall hanging. And that is item number, item number, item N. Okay, then we have another pattern from Cozy Quilt Designs called Romantic Getaway, and it is on sale for $5. And again, it uses a two and a half inch strip set. And then we have a purse, a little, like a little clutch almost. Um, this one here is also $10 and it's on sale for $5. Again, I only have one. Then I have this really cute kitchen scarf pattern. This one here is $6, so it's $3, and I have two. Right, Lynn, I have two of these. Yes. Mm -hmm. So look, they used a coffee-themed fabric. Yeah. There you go, so now you can add a Diana. kitchen scarf. Diana. Who bought the kitchen fabric, Diana. Diana? Oh, Diana, there you go, kitchen scarf now. You can add that to the collection of kitchen themed accessories or a repertoire <laughs> oh my goodness okay so I've got two of these patterns what was that lit right okay so the next few items if you have a brother scan and cut it'll make sense to you if you don't have it I'm sorry I'm um, you know these are these little, um, let me just put it down so you guys can see. This one here is called, it's Tattered Lace. And you, you basically, um, you can grow your library, so to speak, of um, cut files on your scan and cut. So this one here is Tattered Lace and it's um, regular price is $49.95 and it's 50% off. So it's $25 basically. You have two and I have two of these, I only have two. So if you wanna you know, grow your, and these you can see kind of by the picture, they've got some really fun designs on there. Unfortunately, I don't know what else is on there, but there are 20 designs. And it's tattered lace designs. And then on the same token, I have the princess 
paper crafting. So if you guys are into princess or you know someone who is, this would be a fun one. Um, that's a good question, Rosalie. So if you have a brother scan and cut, you do need to just log in and register on the brother canvas um, website. And it's a free account. So you just set up the account. And then when you purchase any of these, um, these little cards, these little um, activation cards, you just put in the code that's on the back of this card and you've just downloaded more patterns or more designs or more cut, I guess. Right, cut designs, cut, I don't wanna say cut work, it's not cut work, but it's almost like SVGs, I guess. So this one here is paper crafting with the princesses and this one here is $40, so it'll be $20 on sale. And I have three of these. Three of these. I have another tattered lace one. This one has, you can see it has a little bow, it has a sewing machine. So it's $49.95 and it is half off. I've got only one of these. And then the last of the collections or these type of things are, it's a rhinestone. So you can add more rhinestone type design. So if you have the rhinestone um, kit for your scan and cut, you can add um, some more rhinestones and glitz away, right? And this one here is $34.99. So $35, half of that. And I only have one of these. Okay, that's that. Then we have, are these, um, these are not heat transfer, right? No, these are adhesive. Yeah, these are adhesive. Okay, so the next thing I have is some adhesive vinyl. Check out this color. It is lime bright green. Can you give one to Lynn real quick, Ram? Um, and this one here is eleven ninety five for the roll, and it's fifty percent off. Oh, she meant to register to buy products, not the Rosalie. Oh, okay. Um, Rosalie to buy products here. Absolutely. Sorry, I misunderstood. Um, so all you need to do is Ram is going to type in our phone number, and just do us a favor tomorrow. Give us a call. Um, give us a call here at the store. We will get your contact information. And if you purchase anything here live on Facebook, um, we will go ahead and give you a call once we process your order. And, um, oh, Liz, you crack me up. I have lovely hands, she says. Thanks, Liz. Um, except my nails are starting to break. It's not a good thing. Um, so anyway, so back to Rosalie's question. So you simply call the store and just give us your contact information and then whatever items you are looking to purchase, once we finish processing your order, we'll give you a call and we'll get your um, payment information and we'll ship out your stuff. If you are local, you can pick it up. And if you are not local, then we are more than happy to ship out your stuff for you and it's free shipping over $49. All right. Oh, you guys are so funny about my nails. I love this color nail polish, though. Isn't it fun? It's all like metallic y. This is a 12 by 19 piece. Well, I think it's heat transfer. Oh, it's heat transfer vinyl? I think so. I think, I think so. Yeah, this is back to some pure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, and it was in where the heat transfer stuff is. So, so I'm sorry, my friend. This is heat transfer vinyl. So this is perfect to put on any of your stuff that you're going to start doing for Halloween. I know, it'd be really cute. Now the green one, I only have one of. However, the bright yellow, I have two of. Look at that color. It is bright, it is so fun. Again, this is um, $11.95, so basically um, $12 and it's on sale for six.
and this one this orange one another bright one although the color doesn't show it on the camera maybe if I let it go it'll zoom in or it'll focus it's 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 a bright orange ran it's not showing up the right color yeah they're all neon I guess that's a good way of saying it they're all neon colors and this orange one I have two of that's what it looks like okay. oh yeah it does yeah I guess it's a little bit brighter. Um, so yeah, I have two of these. And this one is X. I can't believe we went all the way to X today. I know. Wow, we've been done that in a long time. Yes, and again, the size of the vinyl is 12 by 19. Okay. So we're going to change our camera and then um, wrap it up. Oh, people like the orange. <laughs> I was just looking to see which one was X. X was the orange. Okay. So, my friends, I hope you guys had a great, great time. What number did we end up? We ended up at about 37, 38. So, just shy of 40. So, we will do um, a drawing. We'll draw three names today. And so, we will post it soon after we um, end our live. So, keep your fingers crossed that you guys win. It'll be fun. You get a, um, a gift from us for joining us. So thank you. Um, anybody else have any other questions? Any suggestions? You know, we do um, Friday fun days. Um, every Friday we do um, a Facebook Live. So if you guys have suggestions of things you want to see then, let us know. It's always fun to get new ideas. And we, ha we rotate it amongst the teachers and myself and... So it's fun. Thanks, Liz. Thanks, Louise. Thanks, Nancy. It's always fun. It's always fun. It's so fun I came in on my day off. Oh, yeah, yeah. Can you imagine? It's so much fun that Lynn came in on her day off. Can you imagine? Yeah, she has a day off today. <laughs> That's right. She has a day off today, and she comes in for... I, I told her. I said, no, we've got this. Don't worry. We'll make it work. Nope, she came in. So, yeah, it's awesome. Thank you. Thanks, Evie. Thanks, Elaine. <laughs> See, good job, Lynn. You just got a round of applause for coming yeah. in. <laughs> Thanks, Birdie. All right, my friends. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful um, rest of the evening, and we shall chat with you guys real soon. And, again, thanks for your patience for last week's Facebook um, we just ran a little bit behind and you know some people decided to take some time off so it threw us off a loop hint hint Lynn <laughs> I'm teasing I always have to give her a hard time but she knows I love her so it's all good um, okay you're welcome Jerry thank you it's good to see you guys and we shall talk to you guys soon right you guys good I will just bring <laughs> Liz. Yes. Exactly. Just get paid and come straight to the store. Perfect. I love it. <laughs> I love it. It's so funny because one of my customers, she used to leave her, her credit card information. She goes, just keep it because you know what? I'm just going to call you and you'll have my number. And I'm like, oh, my gosh. Yep. That's funny. All right, my friends. You guys have a great evening, and we shall chat with you guys real soon. Bye for now.